this presentation we're going to look at a deferred prepaid expense. We're going to look at it as a short-term asset where we reduce the asset directly and convert it into an expense. A prepaid asset is an asset on the balance sheet and we'll look at its effect on cash which is also an asset on the balance sheet and its effect on expense which is part of net income on the income statement. So what is a prepaid asset? Well, if we look at a timeline here, I got like March through October, and say we use some goods or services. We actually use these goods or services. Say we use them at $600 per month. Um, for example, they might have been supplies used in the office or some consumable item like that. What we need to do is we have to allocate those goods or services to the expense on the income statement. What we have to note here is that we paid for these uh, expenses up front or what we'd call as a prepaid asset. We paid for them up, up front. We, and note here that we use the terminology deferred prepaid expense. Expenses paid in cash and recorded as assets before they are used. Let's go up here and look at a typical journal entry for a prepaid asset. Okay, First thing we do is we purchase the assets. And in this case, we made a payment here of, of $5,000. So we debited the asset, which increased the prepaid asset. And then the corresponding credit entry, which we use cash to purchase these assets here, we would reduce cash by $5,000. So we have these paid for. Now as time goes on we use or we consume these uh, prepaid assets or supplies in this case. So what I used here is um, just consuming at the rate of $600 per month. So we just keep on crediting prepaid assets by reducing that amount here and then the corresponding debit entry would be to the expense where we actually increase the expense by $600. Exactly what we did here for the prepaid asset. So what we, what we want to look at here is that this is a deferred expense over in this area. The expense is recognized after the cash is paid. So we paid for these um, supplies up front and then as we use them we deferred them as, a, as an expense. So that's just a summary of um, prepaid asset or deferred expenses you might want to call it.